Hello again, this is a tutorial on the gallery brick. So um, this is open in preview, um, but that's fine, I think. Yeah, so it's just that page open in preview which we've used for the other tutorials. Uh, the gallery brick is here located in media. I haven't used it very much, but I'm going to give it a go. Not live in edit mode, I'm not really sure what that means. Oh, it means uh, that you can't see the pictures. So we're just going to go and set um, the pictures up. You can see the default folder, it's a lo user's logged in folder, that's the one that's called My Files. Um, so it would display whatever's in there. Um, however, um, so let's go and have a look at what that would preview like. Completely empty, yay. Or maybe there's no images in that folder. Um, so let's go and set it to a folder with images in and see what happens. Um, that's not one, I think this is empty. There you go. I don't know what it's doing there. Um, right, so I'm going to go into my department drafts and um, and there's the department images folder and click on OK. So that's my department images. Now there's a maximum number of thumbnails. I'm going to set that to what? 64? Random. Um, I'm not going to display, I am going to display file names. Um, I'm not going to display meta tags. Uh, you see, you see, you just have all of these, and it, you know, 80 pixels by 80 pixels for the height and width of the image, video width and video height. That's also previews and date descending. So let's just see what happens. Um, oh, it does display. So you can see here, there's bundles of images. Hey, it's me and Keith um, in there uh, that I've done. Now, if you wanted to do images in a particular um, in a particular style, let me just see if we. Yeah, that's quite nice. So. Um, if you click on it, it does this lovely little uh, thing, and you, uh, these are all the solo abstract stuff that I used. Um, so you can go and have a look uh, through the images and, and do whatever you like um, with them. So if you collected, say, you know, um, you went on a field trip, that would be a lovely way to display all the images that you took of an event or of um, resources that you were going to use in the lessons, um, and uh, the pupils can simply um, uh, go through it. And there's a video, all videos in there. I have absolutely no idea. Alright, so I've put one of those up somewhere wrongly. Um, so, you get the idea. So you're going to set that folder, uh, not that folder, this folder, by double clicking. Um, if we, if I go in here, so we're going to department images, no, um, going to DB drafts. Have I got images in there? Yeah, there they are. I'm not sure what's in there, so we'll go and have a look. And you can see there's just a few copies of random images that I've used elsewhere. Um, yeah, so you can do that. Collect a section of images and, um, uh, sorry, get a collection of images, upload them, and you can display them very easily on any web page.